couplers. The SMS, the NFC, and the QR codes, all in this instance, point to the same short URL. That short URL points to the mobile web landing page, the lead gen page you created, and then pushes behind the scenes to an autoresponder of choice. Okay, so this is the acquisition. That in itself is huge. But we're going to take this to the next level. Okay, we're going to take this and now turn it into a mobile coupon that will live in a mobile wallet after you capture the information so you know all the details of the person that got it. You can now have them install it on their phone, change it in real time, retarget them with iBeacons, with Wi-Fi, real-time notifications, and GPS. Okay, all of this is possible with mobile wallet loyalty and local pass. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is create your pass in the system. A lot of you guys saw us create that burger alert pass. Uh, very easy to do. And what I'll do at the end today is also walk you through how to physically use this and, and use the software. I just want to get through the concept first. Uh, so you have this layout and you use this coupon layout for anybody, McDonald's or anyone. Here's a generic example. Um, you have the company logo on top. You have your strip image, which usually says what you're going to get. You have your fine print validity. You have your messages over here. It can be a QR code um, that can be redeemed by any staff in store, or you can have a barcode that's integrated with POS. Okay. And then you redeem it. For example, if it's a barcode or a QR code, um, the staff can scan that. They can update the pass in real time. They enter their secure password. Uh, they can assign points or they can nullify, they can have that coupon as being used, and then it gets redeemed and gets notified via customer uh, with a direct push notification saying thank you for uh, using this and thank you for redeeming your pass, okay? Uh, we actually go through all of this training with local pass. So if you want more on this, we have even our in our members area, we have a step-by-step -step of how to do this.